Hey guys, let me just turn it over here. Turn it, I said. They don't want to hear me talk. You want to hear wrestling, right? After all, this is the first F the first episode of season three of the showdown. I already dropped the remote. Hackenstown. Wow. Is that really a place in New Jersey? I'm being dead honest. Somebody comment that in the comments. Van, Fan, Chan, Ban. Chum, Ban, 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 Yeah, but Bellin is the title match. You become both champions, AEW and Impact. Will Kenny Omega be Impact champion? Of which Swan be AEW champion? We'll see, won't we? Get her back. I'm scared of her. <laughs> Welcome to wrestling, my friend. Susan looks confused, doesn't she, guys? This will be the sixth Hardcore Justice, I think, because it started in 2010. And they've done, like, they didn't do one the next year. This will be the, this will be its 10th anniversary, I mean, 11th anniversary. So, woo, 11 years for Hardcore Justice. That's awesome. Jordan didn't run over because she knows that Jazz is capable of defending herself. 
Deanna Barraza wins the knockouts champion, fells Jazz with a jumping pump kick. And now Deanna in control has a little something for Jordan. As you can see right there before, Susan got involved, and it may not have completely worked, but it did give Deanna that, that window of opportunity to take advantage of Jazz while it back was turned. Oh wow. Look at the neck. She's not hitting the chest, she's hitting the neck. You go lower when you do that, my friend. No, and the thing about Diana is, right now in this match, she is learning. She is taking. Oh God! Close on. From Jazz here, from Jazz as they're in their wrestling, so Diana is constantly trying to improve on her game. You know, as we're strategizing, talking about the official the first episode of Series yeah. 3 so far is looking very good. The AEW World Champion is in this building. His shoes are walking on these floors. What does that do to the entire locker room? The entire show tonight? It is like a seismic shift. It, you know, the Richter scale is used for this because as he walks through, the entire Impact locker room knows where Kenny Omega is. They feel his presence. And it's got it. It's got it. Burn everyone. And he's here tonight. Oh, I think when you say burn, you're thinking fire. But everyone turns and looks at Rick Swap. They turn and they look at, at the guards of Impact. Guys like, you know, Eddie Edwards and Chris Saban and James Storm and Eric Young. What are you going to do about this? How can you allow this to happen? You know, that's the case of protect our turf. This is our house. Don't let someone else walk into your house. See you next video. See you tomorrow for episode episode two of the showdown series three.